Hey guys, it's Derek. So everyone knows now, Bachelor in Paradise was filming. It was the first night, the drinks were flowing. A bunch of the people on the show got kind of drunk, uh, including Corinne Olympios and Demario Jackson. And apparently at one point in the evening, Corinne straddled Demario. They were heavy petting, lots of sexual activity. And then according to Demario, she invited him over to the swimming pool where they got naked, got into the pool, and things escalated from there. And cameras were rolling the entire time. Now Demario says that it never ended up in intercourse because he'd had so much to drink that he wasn't able to perform in that way, but things were still escalating in a very sexual way. So why did the production get shut down? Well, everyone in Bachelor in Paradise has a field producer assigned to them. It's sort of like someone who shadows you throughout the show. Now, the producer who is shadowing Corinne says that the day after this incident, she started hearing a bunch of stories about maybe some sexual misconduct that happened the night before. Now, there were tapes rolling, but the producer didn't see that footage, and it's unclear whether she saw the activity live when it happened. So after the field producer filed this formal complaint, Warner Brothers, the studio behind Bachelor in Paradise, immediately dismissed Corinne and Demario. Then they shortly thereafter shut down the production and launched a formal investigation into the alleged sexual misconduct. Hey guys, quick update. So we have now spoken to sources close to Corinne who say that she feels she was not in any kind of state of mind to give consent to any sexual acts. Sources close to Corinne say that she was blacked out the entire day of filming and felt like producers should have stepped in before everything got out of hand. We're told that she does not fully blame Demario, but does have an attorney and is weighing her legal options. Contrary to what Corinne is saying happened that day, our production sources are saying that in the video footage, Corinne seemed fully engaged. This is a developing story, so keep coming back to TMZ.com for more updates.